Alright, I know the video just started, and I also know that it's been a hell of a long time since I last uploaded, but uh, I'm, I'm really not going to get into that. <clears throat> not going to promise anything or about getting more uploads up or how recent I'm going to be trying to upload this. This game did come out just last month, and I've been meaning to get my hands on it. Quick summary, by the way. And... This game is my childhood, and to have finally gotten it remastered and have it in front of me here like this, uh, wow. So I'm going to play through this and beat this for the child in me and in the past that couldn't beat this before. And oh boy, my, my hands are getting clammy that and nostalgia nostalgia is a hell of a drug all right let's get into this okay
Okay, almost cried a couple of times there because of nostalgia, but I'm okay. I'm okay. No need to worry. <clears throat> um, this game was my very first Final Fantasy, and I just hold it near and dear to my heart. I I could I couldn't like it was hard not to cry, but I I still managed. Um. I also kind of had the uh, intro to this game from like so long ago playing on my phone to compare it, uh, the remastered and, and the classic, and I think I'm ready. <sighs> okay. Uh. As original as it should have been, I'll just go up with that. <sighs> okay, I'm ready. Come, let us record your adventures in this journal. It shall be known as the Crystal Chronicles. But first, we must know the name of your hometown. Oh, right, 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 right. We get to name the hometown. Tipa. Uh. I'm not sure if I should change it for to anything. Probably just gonna keep it as is, just for, uh, of course, nostalgia purposes. Dawn. The morning of my departure was here at last. I tried to brace myself for the journey ahead. There was a field along the main road where I decided to camp until sunrise. Tomorrow I set out in search of Mer. Just saying, I do not remember a thing from the last time I played this. Wait, what is this? I had to collect drops of myrrh from lands far and wide to keep your crystal glowing. Not sure if I remember. Oh, okay. Yeah, this, this, this is a completely new thing as compared to the original. Well, let's allow me to look through the options real quick, if I can. Okay, never mind. Uh, friend data. I guess I have to make a character first? Oh wow. You need a strong party to help run your caravan out on your adventure. Choose out of eight members from the four tribe. What the hell? Ah yes. The regular human class. The halfling guys. These weird bird people. I, I always remember choosing these uh, these ones for some reason. The Ukes or UKs or however you pronounce it. And the Selkies, I so, something something tells me that when I when and if I get into multiplayer in this game, I'm gonna see a lot of these waifu characters walking around. Wow. Okay. So I I, I just I'm able to get the whole cast if I want to. Wait, full character customization? I literally do not remember this. I could be a male Selkie? These exist? Yeah, this is so different from... Oh, okay, so that was a male Selkie in the... Oh, wow. I don't know why, but this whole time I thought this was a... Wow, okay. Wow, okay, um... I'm gonna avoid talking <laughs> until I view this entire thing. Man, look at all of these just character customization things. Oh, classic might wage, I love that. Holy. Like, I don't. <laughs> um. 
Samurai outfit. God damn. What the hell is this? <laughs> I love that. Blue armor. Wait, what are these guys have done? Bumpy. The one horn. Long beak. Black mage? Alright, alright. And. Wow, that looks funky. <laughs> Tulip spiral. Hmm. Something tells me I'm gonna need to cut this part again to figure out what the hell I want to play. Okay, maybe for the sake of this playthrough, I just might have to go with the basic man-child. I, I I have no clue how old these characters are, kind of think of it, but I'm pretty sure age doesn't... Or, age isn't really my point of interest right now. Oh god, there's voices! <laughs> Oh boy, okay. Maybe voice one? Select home job. I'm trying to remember if... I'm trying to remember if this was in the original or not. And I'm not sure if any of this, like, matters? But maybe I'm just gonna go with Blacksmith. And the seven character name. Oh boy. Okay. Um. Oh no. I don't know if I should make a meme name or a legit name. Or if I should just go up with Salt again, I don't know. Actually, you know what? Skull, the wolf that chased the sun. Use this character, you could still edit. Uh, I think. I think this is fine. Oh, hey, oh, there he is. Today you finally step out into the world in search of Myrrh. You will come you you come safely back to Tipa, alright? Oh. Right, right, yeah, sure. Should you find any materials for smithing, bring them back to us, we'll forge you a fine weapon. Oh, okay, so I, I, can, I can see where the job selection kind of ties in. Hey. Don't worry, I'll take care of mother and father. Okay, so this is the family. I, I remember there being a... A family that, that you come back to and I guess bring gifts. Be sure to eat well. Uh, sure, if eating is a thing in this game. A skull, the blacksmith's son, is sent off by his father Arian, his mother Christy, his brother Ram <laughs> Ramsey, and his sister Polly. Well, it's a good thing the game auto gave these family members of mine names, otherwise I would have, uh, would have struggled to make more names. Current element fire. 
Move your caravan with... Okay. What the hell? Oh, voice acting! What the hell? <laughs> you are the caravan from that village, are you not? I heard they were sending out a new caravan. You seem quite capable. Uh, I just started, but yes, thank you. My name is Soul Rock. Um. I am captain of the caravan from the great fortress at Alpetari. Our caravan boasts a history that stretches back thousands of years, but. Let us discuss that some other time. Stiltskin, do you have a moment? This is the village caravan. Come on, say hello. Ah, yes. Moogles. He may not look it. He is a seasoned adventurer. Wait, me or the Moogle? Even we turn to him for counsel from time to time. Oh, the... Okay. No, I'm just a Moogle that likes to get around. <laughs> I like his voice. I learned all sorts of things in my travels before I knew it. I'm on my way somewhere right now, but I can teach you a thing or two if you like. Um. Sure. By the way, are you setting out all by yourself, Capo? Oh, okay. You've got a lot on your shoulders, Capo. Let me carry the crystal chalice for you, Capo. Yes, a capital proposal. Let Mog help you. Well, Fine by me. Let's find a better spot. Okay, so this is the gameplay tutorial, I think. Oh, yep. If you want to ask me something, come here and press the circle button. Okay. Oh yeah, okay. So basically the concept of this game is you're supposed to stay in this thing your entire life, otherwise, uh... Actually. Uh... Yeah, the basis of this game, you're supposed to stay within this circle, otherwise your character gets damaged or something like that. Wow, okay, uh... Let's check through all these. Ah oh, yes, Miasma and the Crystals. Will discovering Miasma, sustained con contact with Miasma will gradually drain your life away. Okay, yep, as I, as I really still remember. To protect us from the Miasma, or Miasma, however you pronounce it. Towns big and small, each maintain a crystal to hold it at bay. Must be purified with myrrh once a year or they lose brilliance. Crystal caravanners like you join her to seek out that myrrh. I've gathered in the crystal chalice. The chalice not only carries myrrh, it also protects the caravan from miasma. Find myrrh trees all over the world. Blocked by hordes of monsters. Ah, oh, yep. That, are, that I remember. Fill your chalice with myrrh before bringing it back to the village. Each tree yields only a tiny drop at once. Hmm. Yep, as I still remember it. It can take as long as two years for it to replenish itself, so keep looking for other trees. Oh boy. Ready for the second step? Yes. Miasma streams on hot spots. Great torrents called the streams of Miasma cut through the world, dividing into sections. Possesses a certain element. To cross the stream and enter the lands beyond, you must change your crystal chalice's element to match that of the stream. Fire, earth, water, and wind. If you're trying to cross the stream of fire, chalice better your fire. Yep. How do you change the element? Place the chalice on platforms called hot spots. Your chalice element matches that of the stream. Okay, all, all this tutorial stuff. Oh, okay. What's up? 
What about weapons? Oh, okay. Okay, so there is like a timing to like attacks. These focus attacks. Hold down the button until you see a targeting ring appear. With the ring with movements and line it up with an enemy. And okay. Oh wow, okay, so so he could actually move it around. Okay, okay. Hmm, alright. Whoops. What about spells? Okay. Oh, all right. Just my blast through this. Do I have a certain amount of time, or er, not time, mana, before I burn out doing this? Fusing spells. Site you find will disappear once you leave its native area. Find urns full of water or oil, throw them into spread its contents all over the floor. Okay, so. What's up? About Mog's help. Hmm, alright. Press the triangle, okay. Okay, and he just follows me around. Alright, we'll be going now. You bet. New diary entry. Oh, and a trophy. Check your diary? Nah. over here. 